Good evening and welcome to the Daily Market Update. The DSEX returned to the red zone today as it fell by 48.94 points or 0.82% today and settled at 5,904 points. Market turnover was 9.99 billion Bangladeshi takas, which is a decrease of 19.69% compared to the previous trading day. Brack Bank, Islami Bank and Citibank from the banking sector, Rabi Axiata and Grameen Phone from the telecommunication sector, and Delta Life Insurance, National Life Insurance and Pioneer Insurance from the insurance sector mainly dragged the market down today. In terms of sector-wise return, the industrial sector posted the highest gain of 0.49%, while the cement sector registered the second highest gain of 0.48%. On the other hand, the banking sector posted the highest loss of 1.97% today. Six insurance companies were among the top 20 losers today. Delta Brack Housing Finance Corp. Mithin in Knitting and Dying and Phoenix Finance and Investments registered the highest gain while Delta Life Insurance, Sonali Life Insurance and Investment Corporation of Bangladesh were the top losers today. Delta Life Insurance fell in value today as there was no price limit on the trading of shares due to their corporate declaration. There is no publicly disclosed price sensitive information for the price change of the remaining stocks. The trading volume of Marico Bangladesh, Islamic Finance and Investment and Olympic Industries increased significantly today compared to the average trading volume of the last three months. There is no publicly disclosed material reason for the volume increase of these stocks. Top two news today. Chattagram, the country's primary seaport, has reached a significant milestone by delivering 5,100 TEUs, 20-foot equivalent units, of containers in the last 24 hours, marking the highest single-day delivery in the port's history. This achievement follows severe congestion caused by nationwide unrest and internet disruption since mid-July. The government has appointed Abdur Rahman Khan, Secretary of the Financial Institute institutions division fid as the new chairman of the national board of revenue nbr replacing abu hana md ramatul munim whose contractual appointment has been cancelled according to a notification from the ministry of public administration he will also assume the role of secretary to the internal resources division ird under the ministry of finance that's all for today thank you